most little girls grow up dreaming of having a pony. But that's not the case for our next guest. Lizards, wombats, even snakes. She loves them all together with her mum and dad, and they're making a real difference. I'll be riding shotgun. Meet little Ashley Neville, who at the grand age of three is braver than most fully grown adults. This is her, handling some pretty dangerous animals under the watchful eye of Dad, Josh and Mum, Amber. Can you not chew my hair? Who needs hairdressers out here in the bush? Together, this terrific trio are giving injured animals a place to recover. Mm. Oh, beautiful way to start the morning. Do you want some too? Josh, a lifelong farmer, now dedicating his time to guiding local wildlife back to good health in their regional Victorian property. Along the way, this adorable family has clocked up thousands of social media followers watching their encounters with the cheeky animals. Stop being a bully! Hey, run for your lives. You all right? Crikey, Moses. <laughs> Crazy out here. There's no order. <laughs> no and that's just how we like it. We're delighted to say they all join us now from Gippsland in Victoria. Hey, guys. Oh, you guys. This is, look, I mean, these videos, they're hey. adorable. In particular, that one of Ashley um, when she was a little bit of a, you know, little girl there in the, in the playing with the little animals. Where did she run? She... <laughs> what? <laughs> she... <laughs> what was that question? Um, when did you know she was a superstar, guys? It was the ginger. Oh, I cut him my throat. <laughs> Well, I guess uh, probably when we started getting some feedback on social media, just how it brightened up their day and how cute she was and interacting with the animals and just how different types of animals we have here, I guess. It just shows how special they are. Oh, she looks like Harper in that video and she's only a three-year-old. Um, it it's must be incredibly rewarding work. Uh, do you ever have, like, run-ins with the snakes? Oh. Uh, yeah, I do a bit of snake catching here for the Shire, so uh, quite often we get calls. So I'm the sort of person that they call when you get a dangerous snake in your house or penned up somewhere. So, yeah, we have a few encounters. But yeah, Ashley comes along, don't you, Ashley? Oh, oh that's cute. I mean, yeah. What you mean is you're a real man. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think so. And yeah. what, have, what about you, Amber? Have you Keeps always had such a love of animals? Yeah, yeah. I grew up on the Gold Coast, but um, Did I didn't have many opportunities with them, so I've got a lot of opportunities now, which has been really fun. Uh, let me tell you, plenty of wild creatures on the Goldie, especially <laughs> at Melba's back in the day. Um, what, what about, what's, what, what's Ashley's favourite animal? What's your favourite animal, Ashley? The uh, wombat? Yeah. <laughs> what she got there? She got a wombat in her hand. And a guinea pig. Oh. Ah. No, that's a little guinea pig. Oh, that's so she cute. She loves her little free range guineas. That's so yeah. lovely. That's so. How many animals have you got? Is it, is it a lot to look after? Um, we just take on what we can handle. Yeah. Um, so normally we do a couple of wombats a year or, you know, having, having baby animals is like having an extra kid. You're sort of getting up in the middle of the night, feeding them. And yeah, it's a lot of work, but it's rewarding. So since Ashley came along, we've had to back it off a little bit. <laughs> yeah, right. And obviously you guys are huge on social media. You've got a massive following. Um, how, how have you been able to sort of turn that into the following that you've had? Oh, I guess it's just from people, uh, a lot of overseas followers, because their wildlife's so unique. And Ashley being such an interactive little girl, that attracted a lot of people just escaping their day, I guess. Mm. Yeah. Makes a lot of people smile and and have a laugh and yeah, so that's sort of why we've kept at it and it's grown a big following. You guys have got lovely energy. Um, thank you so much for being on the show. Before we go, Joshy, how long you've been growing that crazy animal on your head for? <laughs> yeah, a fair while, it keeps me warm, it protects me. It gives me something you need it in Gippsland, it's cold. <laughs> I wish I could grow dreads. Yeah. <laughs> thank you, buddy. Lovely to see you. Uh, lovely uh, family and all our love, right. huh? No worries. See thank you guys. See you guys. Bye -bye. Thank you. Bye -bye. All right, Bye. well, straight ahead. Hey there, today fans, Sarah and... <laughs> What's my name again? Oh my goodness, Carl. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching our YouTube <laughs> channel, though. Subscribe now for more news, special reports and amazing Aussie stories. And Carl misbehaving, Whoa, of course. that never happens. Always happens. What's she talking about?